Hi how are you? I hope that these series of prayers, and daily messages, they are bringing you closer to God, I hope, there are great changes in your life, subscribe if you want the improvements to continue, and if you want to see God's face clearly in your life. Today we will make a prayer for mothers, we will pray for protection, for those who have no mother, the mother, represents the figure closest to God, because for a child, to be loved, to know that you come from another body, is very important even if you don't admit it, you feel subordinate. The love of a mother, can represent, perhaps, the greatest love on earth, immediately after the love of God. We will pray for these things, so get ready to enter into the presence of God, I remind you to close your eyes if you want, because it helps our spirit to come forward, however, know that it is not mandatory, close your eyes. Open your heart, and know, that in a few moments, you will get in touch with God. Take a few seconds to prepare your heart, pause if you want. Well. Now we are ready. Prayers. Hello Father, how are you? Today I want to talk to you, as a sign of faith, that you, really are listening to me. First of all, I love you too much. You are the reason for my life, without you I could not live, without you everything is black and white, you make me live in color, paint my days of joy, of love and unique emotions. Today I want to appreciate you, for the fact that you exist, for the fact that you are the righteousness of the world and of heaven, for the fact that you constantly send me signals of love, and for the fact that he never leaves me alone, I am aware that sometimes I try, but I love you also for this, I know that for every test, it presents itself a higher level. Every day with you, it is worth more than a thousand elsewhere, a day with you is worth more than all the gold in the world, all the beauties that can exist, thank you my love. Today, sir, I beg you, to cleanse me from all sin, I ask your forgiveness in the name of Jesus, and in you trust that you will be good and just to forgive me, my request today, go to you, for the hearts of mothers, their broken hearts, that they had problems, like, betrayals, disappointments, which were mistreated, who had a bad childhood, that they were little loved, who had a poor economic situation, today, Lord, please. Touch their hearts, grab their lives, with your powerful hand, refresh, in the name of Jesus. Be refreshed. Be renewed. Be renewed. In the name of Jesus. Sadness of the past, leave them, now. And don't come back again. Every bad situation they have experienced, every problem, every disappointment, every bitterness, leave them now in the name of Jesus. Spirit of joy. Fill their lives. Spirit of perfection. Go to them. May the Spirit of God come to know them, time of the names of the people you want to pray for one. Two, three. Yes, Lord, I entrust them to you. From now, I believe you will reveal your face, not only to them, but also to the people close to them, for you are the God of the gods, the Lord of lords. My Father, my love. I know that you are the source of all good, send signs and wonders, send them so that they know, how powerful you are, glory to you for the souls who will know you as God, as Father, as a guide, in the name of Jesus. Here. The daily prayer is over. His presence now and there with you, try to feel the love and grace of God. If you can't hear anything, don't worry, it means that you need more time with Him. You can talk to our Father for another two minutes, if you want, you can make Him requests, you can thank Him, be open, the Lord is a person, you can't see Him because, He, it gives the possibility to all, to believe, to have a choice, to choose between good and evil, if everyone saw the Lord, every man would be as if forced to choose God, now that you know this, try to believe that He is right in front of you, then you will understand what I am talking about. Well. I hope you are better and I pray for the people, close to your life, that they can be touched by God. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't, in order not to miss another appointment with God, and remember, put God first in your life, and He can put you at the beginning of all His thoughts. Thank you for being with us.